A lot of you may be familiar with the work FFA does through agriculture education here in Georgia. Now today we take a look at one positive aspect of the industry certification program that is highly touted amongst state educators, both those connected to agriculture and those on the outside of the industry. Lula Curry Williams is the FFA advisor at Macon Bibbs Northeast High School. Now, it may not be the first place that comes to mind when you think of the future farmers of America. Chris Corzine, Central Region Ag Educator Director through the Georgia Department of Ed, points out that educators have recognized there is so much more to the industry than simply being on a farm. Uh, today's agricultural uh, education classrooms, uh, they're not just about sows, cows, and plows. They're also about leaders, speakers, and job seekers. We deal with agriculture every day. Everything that we deal with, uh, you know, just in our communities, our, our yards, you know, the grass growing in it, the, the weeds growing in it, how do we take care of that stuff? Uh, the shrubbery that we're putting in there for our decorations, you know, what color, when do we need to plant them, what time of year do, do they going to grow and look the best? And the thing about it is we're teaching that in our high schools to these kids that they're going to take with them for the rest of their life. Williams has students that are involved in learning in the classroom, a greenhouse, an outside garden, and a floral design shop made possible by FFA. You have uh, the organization itself, you know, the FFA, and then we have uh, the SAE, the supervised projects, and then we have the classroom and laboratory. Uh, those are the three components of agriculture, and they connect together. We can't do without, we can't have one without the other. So the organization, when they join that, it gives them a a worldwide things where they can venture out into the different careers you know that they want to. One of the students in Williams Ag class said being part of FFA has made a significant impact on how she plans to proceed with her education. Agriculture is important because it's the way that humans survive, whether it's through food, clothing, transportation, all of that. It's not just about food, because a lot of people at Northeast thinks it's about farming, but it's so much more. And Ms. Curry just teaches us an aspect of that, but when we go out and interact with other FFA chapters, we really get to learn more about the animal industry, the clothing industry, even the communication industry. Because without agriculture, humans would not really have progress throughout the years. Kevin Chomp a major force among ag educators in the classroom for the Central Region told us that because of the ag industry certification standards, programs like this one at Northeast is flourishing. Uh, throughout the state of Georgia, uh, agriculture teachers and, and other CTA teachers uh, have the opportunity to be industry certified. And, and basically that's the stamp of approval that comes from industry about what's going on and what they're doing. You know, a lot of teachers have the credentials that, that they've gained from uh, college education and teaching experience, and they have some tools, but the, the, the stamp of approval that comes from industry, and, uh, their support of what's going on uh, is essential, really, to, to provide the quality education that students need to, to really be successful. And the funny thing is the kids, they, re they don't even realize that they're learning the things that they're learning. You know, they, oh, we go to the greenhouse, we do this, we do that. The thing about it is you're really learning something, they're truly learning something while they're out there. 